Ambi's tower will soon be complete. Going on vacation. That's fun. Family vacations are always the best. Uh-oh, I was skipping text. Uh, all of history shall remember me as the greatest of queens. Link, you have the echoing howl, but things are not going well. The Black Tower is nearing completion in the past. Terrible things will happen if you don't hurry. I hear an essence echoing from the peaks northwest of Linus City. Can you go? Well, of course I can. Now, this is an important stage of the game. Uh, because next, we... Dee Dee. found this red fish. We're dying to savor its exciting flavor. Hey, what are those seeds? They have ember seeds. What an exciting name. Will you trade ember seeds for our fish? Sure. It's a deal. I can't wait to taste it. Crack. Munch. Munch. Oh! Hot, hot. Don't worry, Dimitri. I was almost eaten. I'm Dimitri. I can swim in the sea. Are you going somewhere? I can give you a ride. I chomp when you press A, and swim like a fish, even up waterfalls. I can carry you. you can carry me using the power bracelet. So, unique properties of Dimitri is that he can swim in the deep ocean. Which is something that even Link can't do with the flippers. So this is how Link is able to travel when uh, going on the ocean currents. Right down here, this is going to be one of the sections that I will plant a seed in. By the way, I did change things as a result of me needing to replay back up to Dungeon 3. So, I do not have some of the rings that I had appraised before. Or planted some of the gaseous seeds that I had done before. We're here. You go along now. Bye. Bye, Dimitri. Now, that is our third and final animal buddy that we get to experiment with. Because the next time we get to see them, they are our official animal buddy. There are different ways to procure the animal buddy, uh, definitively. I think if you buy this, you get Ricky, the kangaroo with the punching bags. If you complete the mini game, uh, which is somewhere. Uh, you get another mysterious loot. That one is for Moosh, I think. And if you don't do anything at all, you get Dimitri's. So now our loving family. Your boy's still ill and you have something to teach. Finding new plants and Gasha. Okay. Samus looks a little strange. I want you I want to take him to a doctor, but I have no rupees. Could you please lend us some? Sure. How much can you lend us? Let's go the full amount. You are a true Samaritan. I gotta make sure my Samus is all healthy. Anyways, the direction that the game wants me to go in next is I have meat. Where's Mama Yama? Right here. Mama Yan, the top breeder in town. Nothing's cuter than your dog to hide his face. 
So she wants a mask. But I have tasty meat. Using the ember seeds, we can activate this bridge. And I think... Maybe this guy wants food? I'm so hungry, my stomach hurts. Ah, I'm hungry. Pardon me. I just thought you could help. Ah, I'm hungry. Give him tasty meat. Yes. Ha, ah, meat. What's this? Hand it over. Food at last. Oh, oh. Why are you staring at me? Oh, you want something. How greedy. How mean. You won't leave until you get something? Fine, you can have this. Pa, meat. You got the doggy mask. So let's go to Mamao Yan, who wanted a way to cover up her dog's face for some reason. Also, we are now on technically the next episode of YouTube. Every episode of YouTube is going to be a different segment of the game, being whether it's a dungeon or the path to a dungeon. So keep that in mind. I uh, give her the doggy mask, yes. Got the dumbbell. What's wrong, boy? I only had one to begin with. Uh, somebody wants to lift, I think, in Symmetry City. So I guess we're gonna make our way up there then. Highly recommend. Oh. Fine. I wasn't expecting Maple to just fly off so quickly. Oh no. Is this gonna be a moosh? This is Moosh, isn't it? I wanted Dimitri. No. Darn it. I guess Dimitri was the one you get from completing the shooting game. Those lazy, worthless fools, just as we're building this bridge to the Symmetry City ruins, they go off on break. I wait and I wait, but they don't come back. We'll never get that bridge done at this rate. I'd go find them, but the terrain round here is too rough. A man can't navigate on it on his own. <sighs> what a fix. So I think... No, that's telling me that this is a Ricky map, actually. So, something that I'm trying to hint at is that this area of the map changes based on which animal buddy you're supposed to get. Mister, I found you! Listen, it's a mess. A big winged bear-like animal got lost in our forest and can't get out. We're... We were playing a little trick, but now it'll never get out. Can you help us find it? Do you get our problem? Yes. So this is how you get Moosh. I was slightly wrong. I wanted Dimitri because then I could go back to the ocean. Moosh is good, though. I mean... Wait, mister. This way. It's deep in the woods. Hey, Aaron. Oh, great. They 
shuffled the map again, didn't they? Ah, uh, why do you have to do this to me, guys? And by guys, I mean the great fairies. Aha! Found him. I'm back in the same spot. I'm so hungry I can't move. Oh, you chased away ghosts. Mister, you found it. Okay, we'll take you back to the edge of the forest. Yay. You won't get lost here. Sorry we didn't mean it, but seeking is more fun than hiding. Really? I want to do it again. Next time will be harder. Come play with us again, okay? Goodbye. Thank you for helping me out. I haven't told you my name. Please tell me. Oh. Link, that's easy to remember. First the graveyard, now this. You are always helping me out, Link. I must help you in your adventures too, Link. So take this flute. Play that flute when you need me. I'll come if I hear it. Moosh will come to your aid. Now, Moosh cannot come to the past with us. So just be aware of that, he is unable to time travel. Let's get this, 50 rupees, how lucky. So now that we have Moosh, we're able to fly over wide gaps. Gaps that we probably wouldn't be able to get over even if we had the Pegasus seat. I'm doing good, Aaron, by the way. I know I haven't responded to that question yet. It's been a long-ish morning as I had to redo Dungeons 2 and 3 on my own personal time. But now we're gonna get to... Oh no. Yes, I made it. Okay. First guy, my boss is an ornery fellow. He does no work, but complains about quality. Are you kidding me? I have to talk to the boss again. Oh no, I've died. We will save and continue. It's been revealed! I'm emulating the game! My dark secret. You know, I was actually supposed to bring the cartridge so that I can show you guys that I own the games legitimately and that I'm like okay but I didn't bring it with me each of the forest animals actually does have a unique song to their flute which is a unique touch they could have just done one song Okay, let's talk to the ornery boss now that we have a buddy. Sure. Okay. So 
so now when we talk to this carpenter, huh, the boss, but I wanted to hang out a while longer. But I can head back. Yeah, you can. The joik. Okay, let's do this guy next, potentially. Okay, we have a treasure chest. With a ring! Sweet. Okay, we made it through. Let's go talk to this carpenter. Not the boss, but I want to hang out a bit longer. My goodness, these guys. The one thing you want right now is a mocha frappuccino. The one thing I want right now is for Moosh to actually be good at flying. There we go. Uh, what kind of mocha frappuccino? Because I think there's, like, many different styles of the Frappuccino, if I remember correctly. Okay, let's jump off. Go in here. <gasps> it's a great fairy. Heal my weariness. Give me the love. Boss, you wanted to hang out a bit more. And now we've made it back. Ha, they're finally here. They were just late. We'll get to work. No more breaks until the bridge is done. Yes, boss. Yeah, get me to... Wait. He said Symmetry City Ruins. We're done, boss. What? You're already done? Guess you fools can work. But no time for breaks now. On to the next job. Yes, boss. Okay. So what does this guy mean by Symmetry City Ruins? Oh. He actually means ruins. Get the Gale Seeds, which allows us to now teleport to any of the seeds uh, in the area. So we could travel around and pass this room, but we're not going to do that. Also, because this city is called Symmetry City, what's on the left is also on the right. Okay, now we can actually enter these ruined buildings. Help, help, the tuning nut is broken. What, will you listen to my problem? Sure. The closer the Black Tower gets to completion, the stranger this city gets. Welcome back, Aaron. When the tuning nut broke, the city fell out of balance and the volcano started erupting. The tuning nut is the city's symbol. We dutifully worshiped this nut. The rules of Symmetry City requires that left and right be in perfect balance. But the tuning nut at the center of the city is broken. Symmetry City is all out of balance if we don't get the tuning nut fixed and put back. Symmetry City will be destroyed by the eruptions. Do you understand? 
Um, why not just remove the Toonie Nut? Then your city's back in balance. I've given the Toonie Broken Nut to my husband, but he can't climb Restoration Wall. I don't think this is the husband. Sway right, sway left. Move right, sway left. Move right, sway left. I'm so skinny, I wish I could change. Sway left, sway right. I know, I'll work out, except I only have one dumbbell. Maybe it's this guy's fault your city is out of whack. Sway left, sway right. Working one arm at a time, it goes against my policy. If I can't do right and left at the same time. Sway left, sway right. Sway left, sway right. He seems to be fixated on your dumbbell. Give him the dumbbell? Yes. That's it. That what I wanted. Now I can lift, lift, lift. I'll get all the girls now. <laughs> sway left, sway right. I'm so skinny. I can't offer you much. Hmm, I know. Rip. I gotta work out. You got the cheesy mustache. It looks weird. Get the girls. Get the girls. Okay. So now I need to find the Toonie Nut. That's a boy. You good sir. Ow, I was injured by a rock that shot out of the eruption. If you want the Toonie Nut, go see my brother across town. So here's the erupting volcano. The closer the Black Tower gets to completion, the stranger the city gets. When the tuning nut broke, the city fell out of balance. Uh, it's the exact same thing. But I can't leave this place alone. The symmetry the city left and right have to be in perfect balance. My brother is too hurt to move, so I can't move either. If one brother goes somewhere, the balance between left and right will be lost. But someone has to go. Hey, you can't ignore the rules and leave the city, can you? Take the tuning nut to patch? Sure. Before battle. Uh, take it to the middle of the city and put it on the pedestal when it's fixed. Again, just throw the nut away and like gone out of existence. If it's out of the city, then the balance is already fixed. You nut jobs. Anyways, next thing we have to do... Hmm... So the way to get to Patch is kind of odd. Don't ignore me. Oh, maybe it is in this era. Dive down this hole. So we have the tune of Echoes, and right up here, we have this weird room. Did you know fan and sword are an element? Don't ask why you said that, it's a from an avatar show. So if we talk to the man, he says he wants to hear a great song. He is Toki. Research time. After many years of research, he's one step to perfection. A tune that will let them move forward in time. But it seems he has hit a roadblock. Echoes makes waves. What could it mean? Now you play this song. That's the tune of Echoes. That's the tone my research lacked. It has answered my remaining questions. Now I can finish my tune.
Ye of many tunes, I grant you a new tune. Time flows on when you play the tune of currents. When you play this tune, you'll immediately drift back to your own time. If you are in a place from which you cannot reach your own time, you'll return to the past. The tune of current, which could be something related to Din because of the symbol. Play it to move from the past to the present. Choose it when you use the harp. So, to demonstrate its musical powers. It's quite impressive, actually. Cut the fish and swim on. Now this is an important uh, piece of the puzzle. Because now, when we come down twice, When we only had the tune of currents, we would see this tree stump, and we would do the tune of echoes there. But if we tune the do the tune of currents here, it will take us to this side of the rocks. It does not work the other way, though. It won't take us from the present to the past. So we still have to utilize the Tune of Currents when we want to go back in time. to ask, but what's the point of this game? Is it a game that has an end, or is it a game that has no end? How do you win? So this game's end, I will have to show it in the past, but you have to collect eight essences of time in order to enter a veil of darkness so that you can... Uh, fight the big bad boss person It is a game with end as all Zelda titles are Just as soon okay, here we go So the point of this game is that an evil sorceress named Varen has taken the Oracle of Ages back in time and convinced the Queen of Labrina to build the Black Tower. A tower that is supposed to show Queen Ambi's love back to the land of Labrina. However, uh, Varen, the Sorceress of Darkness, Soro, Sorceress of Soro, is using the Black Tower to create an Age of Darkness. So we are trying to stop Varen from achieving her dark designs. And to do that, we need the power of... of... the essence of time, which have been scattered across the different ages of Labrina in order to achieve this. This is one of my favorite Zelda titles, and I do hope that it does get a remake. Perhaps in the style of the Oracle of uh, Link Between Worlds, because that game style is so nice. So now we need Tune of Currents. This is also in canon to Zelda lore, a trial of wisdom for Link. Take out the bombs, throw them in the pool, 
Did you drop the gold bomb or silver bomb? Well, I dropped the regular bomb. You are an honest person. I'll increase the number of bombs you can carry to reward you. Yeah! She's blowing me up. You can now carry 30 bombs. And I've filled your bag. Farewell. That is why it is good to go to that area. Is Zelda a computer PC game or is it on mobile? Zelda is on Nintendo Switch. Uh, Nintendo Systems. This particular game I'm emulating because it's honestly the only way that I can play this game for a stream. Um, but I do have the original cartridge for the Nintendo Game Boy Color. So if you're looking to get this game, it is from 2001. It's probably super expensive by now, especially when you want... Oh wait, I mean... I can cross water. Uh, but there are other Zelda titles you can play if you don't want to just be locked into Zelda Oracle of Ages. Its sister game, Oracle of Seasons, is also for the Game Boy Color. Zelda's Link Awakening is for the Game Boy. Zelda's a waterbender. No, go away. No! Stop hitting me. Okay. So I think what I want to do is go back to the present here. Because there is a treasure chest, I believe, that you can... I'm so sorry for hitting my mic. If you spawn in a spot that you can't walk around on, that happens. So we're going to go over one, because I do want to make sure that I get as much of the map screen filled as well. That's not what I wanted. A Gasha Seed. Okay, so there's nothing important. So this is actually also a really unique concept because it does have similarities to The Legend of Zelda Oracle Ocarina of Time because you're able to travel back and forth between the present and the past in Ocarina of Time. A time span of seven years to be exact. Super Mario Bros. 3 with your mom when she was feeling, when she feel of a let fell off a ledge, and just laughed and laughing because it looked funny. I shouted, Luigi committed suicide. <laughs> like, why was the fall funny? It's, it's funny because of how sometimes it does happen. Like, I laugh off an accidental fall a lot because that's not what I intended to do. Alternatively, I laugh because the game will make me fall because I missed the platform based on the placement of the game. And then I'm like, oh, you cheeky game. Welcome to Patch's Crazy Cart. Will you partake in my ceremony? Yes. Very well. Do you want to hear the rules? Sure. Then let me explain. I'll place your toonie nut on the green tile and recite the words of my restoration ceremony. You must knock all the beasts that appear into the hole. Any hole will do. Sounds easy, right? However, the restoration is delicate work. 
your precious tuni nut sits on these tracks. The cart starts moving when the ceremony begins. As long as you stand on the switch, the cart won't hit your tuni nut. But if you don't get it, but if you don't and it gets hit, bang. So, will you take part in this fun, uh, delicate ceremony? Sure. Let the ceremony begin. So what I want is actually... Uh, not that. Your gram said, open your windows to get some breeze. And I said, but I have a fan on. I'm getting some breeze. And she... Wait, no, I want... It is interesting that that's what happens. But like, for me, I, I just didn't take better delicate care of what I was trying to do. So we got the tuning nut fixed, now we can go back to the... Uh, Symmetry City and fix their, uh, curse. I think it's supposed to be some sort of curse. But let's go back to the present real quick, because this is a unique area of the map. And then there's also areas of the map that I have to explore in the corner. Okay, so, back to the past. Let's go put... This on the pedestal. And now the city is saved. So if we go back to the present, 